guys, it's me here again, and I'm going to show you how a to pear. make a, a pear. Well, it can be either a pear, orange, or marshmallow. marshmallow. And here's my sister. And I have also made a smaller orange. Maggie. And here what I'm going to make now. It is, I think it's midget apple. Midget apple. There I go. So there, there's that. And it starts off just as a plain piece of paper, a plain thing on a plain piece of paper. As you can see, it looks a bit like a flower. And then, what, and then you need to cut it out. After you've done that, you need to fold in all these little bits. And so we have folded every line. And then you need to fold in the little white tabs. I just do that now. But make sure not to fold them in too much or you won't get it done. Oh, and if you can, like, if you want, you can cut off the top bit where the head will, the head will go. And so you cut that off and you could stick all your pencils inside or rubbers or whatever you want. So I'm halfway round. I've only got four more to fold in. Then on with the gluing. Two more. Here we are. Two. One more. One more time. So we've got them all folded in, hopefully. If you find it too small to fold in, I'm sure that there's another thing that you can stick on there. So you folded them all in. Now we use the glue. It can be print stick, anything. So our first time with this glue, so get it ready. So it's very twisty <laughs> and loose. So you fold in the bottom bit so it's got a little ledge and start on whichever side you want to and glue the not this side because otherwise you'll have it sticking over the top like that and you'll have your little figure thing with white stuff all around it which I wouldn't really like with mine so just glue the side which has the apple on it or pear or orange or marshmallow but for marshmallow this is different so then you need to just push it on like that and rub it a little bit then fold the back bit up and this bit must be strong because this is what it holds all together so the two bottom bits this bit as well because if they just come undone, then the whole thing would bad. <laughs> okay, how are you doing? Good. Sure? Yeah. That's sticking. Okay. I'm talking that on a line. Why did you make up no line? Wow. You made all of them into a line. Yeah. I took it to the second line.
Don't touch your eggs. It's your eyes is gonna go in the line. Push it on the bottom, the bottom, the bottom. So you've got, and you've done that. Got the both sides pushed down already. You should notice that he has a very stylish hairdo. Not. And then you basically need to do the same so it all tucks into a hexagon as I can show you with orange. So it's all just like that. And you need to. Sorry, eggs. That hurt your finger. No. Sure? sure. It does tend to make my little finger. Oh, it's already better. It is. Stick that on. On this first side. What was that, Angie? That was my dragon. That was my funny face. And my you need funny. to do the same on the other side, so it looks like that. That's tucked in. This side still needs to go in like that. And this side goes on top. So I'll just glue these. Just put so then he only has one left, and this is the bit where the pencil case comes in. I mean, pencil holder. You can either have this chopped off so you have a hollow inside to put all your pencils in like that but you can also print them bigger and smaller. and smaller but it's very fiddly to get smaller because I tried to do a marshmallow but he completely went out but for a normal one just need to fold like glue it all together then Fold it all in, press it all down, there you have your apple. Mid apple. Thanks for watching from Orange Pear Marshmallow and Midget Apple. Bye!